styles of baseball that they play. Batting eight for red, number two, the center fielder, Dylan Head. Gacka will be low 90s with his fastball. Interesting in, in that at this point in his career, he's already had Tommy John surgery. So he's bounced back from that. It's not an impossibility that a pitcher would have to undergo that multiple times in a career, but something to consider. And it's always interesting, interesting to see how you know, pitchers can respond after that because, like, you'll watch some pitchers and, like, they still can go on and have the amount of success. It's just knowing that you can rely on your arm when you're on the mound. Hard grounder over to shortstop Kevin McGonigal. Vacuums it up and makes the toss across the diamond for out number one. McGonigal's looked really good at shortstop. We know of his hitting prowess. He was four for four yesterday, but made some smooth plays in the infield for Team Light Blue so far this week. First pitch, a breaking ball to Rodriguez, Christian Rodriguez. His first plate appearance did not play yesterday. Fastball misses low. Here we go, another pitcher who might occasionally lose the lid. Drifts one high and outside. Two and nothing to count. 94 on that last fastball outside the zone. For Gackle, by the way. And ball four issued. And looking at these pitchers all sitting in the and 90s, low to mid. And if you're Cam Johnson going up to the high 90s. And it's still just thinking about yesterday's game one starter for Team Gray sitting in, you know, the high 80s. But still was solid, what, five strikeouts? And three innings of work. Jake Brown pitching, I think, also another LSU commit. Gackle now from the stretch. That one's laced into right. Farmello with a base knock. Rodriguez holds up at second. And with one away, there are runners at first and second. Going back to the top of the order now for a chance to put a number on the board, maybe take the lead. Adrian Santana, a strikeout looking on six pitches his first time up. Was two for two yesterday. Back to the top of the lineup, the second baseman, number four, Adrian Santana. Switch hitter. So this is his first time in the left-handed batter's box today. Because against the lefty Cam Johnson, he hit right-handed. Gackle starts him with a fastball right down Broadway, 0-1. Late movement on that one as well. It's nice to see the different types of fastball in these pitches, in these pitchers' arsenal. Another heater on target for Gackle. It's 0-2. Timeout snuck in there. A couple of fastballs. You think he throws another one here? Finish it off? I think conventionally you'd think he 
try to waste one here. So if it is a fastball, it's going to be way off the mark. Goes breaking ball instead. Gets a swing and a miss, and Santana strikes out for the second time today. Oh, man, that is brutal. That is a quick-moving breaker. Look at this. I think that's a textbook definition of a power curve. He threw that as hard as he could, and that thing just broke like a Kit Kat on the way in. On to Maxwell Clark. Off the mark with the first. It's up and in, 1-0. and oh. Ground ball to third base his first time up. That was that weak dribbler on the first pitch he saw. Bounced up the middle. McGonigal makes 